Hi there. In this video I'll be explaining how to calculate the current in an electrical device and which fuse to use with it. The most common fuses used with electrical devices are the 3 amp and the 13 amp. The fuse is placed here in an electrical plug between the live terminal and the live pin. It's designed to protect the flex by breaking if the current increases above the fuse's current rating, which in this case is 3 amps. If a fault develops in the electrical device, this can cause the current to increase and so a wire inside the fuse melts. This means there's now no current in the flex, so there's no chance of it overheating and starting a fire. So the fuse is basically a safety device. In this video, we'll be looking at the ratings plate of three devices. This tells you the power rating and operating voltage of the device, and we'll use this equation, power is equal to current times voltage, to calculate the current in the device, rearranging the equation like so. When choosing a fuse, you should use the one with the lowest current rating possible although this must be higher than the normal operating current of the device. So a device with an operating current of, say, 1.5 amps should be fitted with a 3 amp fuse, whereas a device with an operating current of 3 amps or greater should be fitted with a 13 amp fuse. Here's the first example. This is the ratings plate from a table lamp. Remember we're using the equation I is equal to P divided by V to calculate the current in the device. P is power, which in this case is 40 watts, and V is the voltage, 230 volts. That will be the same for all three devices. That's the value of the mains voltage in the UK. Substituting these values into the equation gives a current of 0.17 amps. So the table lamp should be fitted with a 3 amp fuse. The second example is a hedge trimmer with a power rating of 0.6 kilowatts. Remember that this should be converted to watts, since that's the correct SI unit for power. The current then is 600 divided by 230 is equal to 2.61 amps. Again, a 3 amp fuse should be used. Finally, we have a toaster. This has the greatest power rating so far, 800 watts. Now, devices which convert electrical energy to heat tend to have large power ratings. The current in the toaster then would be 800 divided by 230 which gives us 3.48 amps. So the toaster should be fitted with a 13 amp fuse. If you were to use a 3 amp fuse, it would break even if the toaster was operating normally. Now you've probably realized that there's a cutoff point where any power rating above a certain value would need a 13 amp fuse and below it would need a 3 amp fuse. You can calculate using the equation P equals IV with a current of 3 amps. The value works out to be 690 watts. So if the power rating of the device is below 690 watts, you'd use a 3 amp fuse, and if it's greater than or equal to 690 watts, you'd use a 13 amp fuse. That's all for now though. If you've not subscribed yet, then feel free to do so, and tell all your classmates about this channel. Thanks for listening.